Hello and welcome to another episode of Let's Play with Asperwitch. We are playing Crusader Kings 2. And it is actually Crusader uh, Kings because we are uh, the target of the Catholic Crusade for East Francia. We are winning, however, because the Pope is a silly man in a silly hat. Uh, have an uprising here as well. So we're gonna have, have to handle both at the same time. Uh, let's see. Is there something flowing between here and Nuremberg? No. So we're free to go into it and fight that. Ah, right. Praha. Mm. I like this. Uh, yeah. Thank you. So do you have any money? No. Then you can die. Can be ignored. Now this feels like a place where there's a hidden river. No. Thankfully. Getting better reinforcements, that's good. Uh, Wrath of the Old Gods, in response to the new era of crusades and jihads among the Abrahamic no monotheists, the great high priest of high priest Ulinix has informed all Rome of Volves of his plans for a magnificent Roman pagan response. In fact, all pagan heads of religion may now declare great holy wars. This could be the beginning of unprecedented heathen aggression. The old gods are mighty. Look at that, so whole great holy wars. This is good. We do like that. Pope has new troops here. Uh, another grandson. Not the best of ideas, but uh, whatever. <sighs> yeah. And another son. He will take the kingdom of Ruthenium. Uh, okay. Feels like my main heir will get nothing when I die. Poor guy. So I guess I'll let you get into Osnabrück. Something like that. We'll pick you up there. It's quite a pain chasing after him. He's so afraid. Tiny Pope. Uh, yeah, so when this crusade is over and done, which will be soon, we will keep going north into Sweden, Norway, Denmark, Sweden, and Norway. They have one holy site each, the Norse faith, uh, Sjelland, Upland, and Naumadal. We will take those three, we will convert to uh, Norse faith, and we will reform it. That will actually make us, uh, uh, yes, I don't remember what it's called, but we will be the, my daughter-in-law, really? Please. Uh, knights. No, Teutonic Order. Well, we'll kill them anyway. Uh, yeah, I was saying... Ooh, look at this, we can banish him. No, I can't. Uh, I was saying... We will be the uh, head of religion, and we will be able to call our own Great Holy Wars. Uh, I inherited a duchy that I don't want, right? Well, I guess I could keep it. Brunswick. Um, oh well. We'll keep it for now. It's not like it's going to waste or anything. Uh, I need to keep an eye on what way I take into Lausitz, though. Um... 
So what's this? Oh, I got a free castle in Zealand. Well, about you. Already rot. Sea land. That's here. We will just. Uh, you know what? Let's give. Let's give it to him. Give it to him. Uh, Barony of that place. There you go. Now what's this? <sighs> Libush. Brandenburg is Lubbush as well, so we are screwed either way. But he will be going into Brandenburg September 1st. We will get there far too soon. So we'll have to go around. Do not want to cross a river. No, that's never a good idea. Good, good, good leaders. Uh, they do have hills though, that's not good. We are winning, so that's fine. It did hurt though. 84%. Is that enough to actually end this war anytime soon? Or do we need to get freaking 100%? Ouch! I do not like. Where's my holy order friend? Hmm. Well, seems like I'm losing my first battle. Before I do, maybe I should. I could get a white piece. Uh, I will get a lot of piety and prestige. Uh, I don't really care about the Slavic moral authority. So yeah, it's... It's a bit of piety. Uh, a bit of prestige. But that's the only difference. Sorry, so I'm gonna go with a white piece before I lose this uh, battle here. Because when I do, that's gonna lower our war score. Oh well. White piece! Crusade for East Transia fails. Thank you. Need to let go of our levies. Look at our. Oh, so now we actually get light cavalry, because we are Polish. I didn't think that through. Oh well. I can handle light cavalry as well. It'll be fine. Uh, so yeah. Polotsk is converting into Slavic. You know what? Old Slavic. We want to get rid of Old Slavic. First and foremost. So let's do that. Getting a lot of rebels here. Uh, why is that? Maybe it's because of my... Uh, split religions. It's... Peasant... Sorry, two peasant rolls. Uh, so who's this guy? What will happen if I... Well, I can ransom you. Let's, let's look at that. Got some people to ransom. Um, that guy. Nice, some some money in my pockets. Uh, yeah, I'm lost for words. Uh, oh, so the king of Bohemia is actually my vassal now. How did that happen? Did my huh? I have a feeling that Wieslaw is the man I made, right? The lowborn. He has no parents, so he is actually lowborn. He is the first of his house, first of his name. 
uh, King of the Bohemia and the Andals. Um, so he usurped the Kingdom of Bohemia because I gave him this duchy. He had enough territory to, to actually usurp it. And that's fine. I wonder if I have low enough uh, moral... Oh, sorry. Crown loss. Uh, he can actually... Declare war. Hmm. I guess. I guess he can get his territory into into my territory. Uh, yeah. Need more. Uh, need more troops. To fight this, uh, these rebels. Yeah, and then what? Uh, guess Denmark is our next target. Holstein is part of East Francia, which is annoying. But we can always just uh, move through it. Need to find someone, someone good. How about him? No, I already gave him titles. So how about him? I will give you the county of Oldenburg, I guess. No, that was not it. Uh, so, what will I give this guy then? County of Osno. Oldenburg, Osnoburg. Well, I guess it was everything that's my guy. Tecklenburg. Where's that? Osnabrück, yeah, so that's what we want to give away to this guy. Osnabrück, ah, uh, there you go. I was gonna say Varsågod, but that's Swedish. And some of my viewers don't speak Swedish, so yeah, I'm gonna try to keep this in English. Uh, oh, please, Wendish Old Slavic Revolt. Oh my god. Well, the good thing is that uh, revolts are actually quite easy to easy to handle in this, in this game as well. Uh, they will eventually run out of troops and then you can just kill what they have left. So maybe it's a bad idea to, to go fight them, but yeah, whatever. Gotta do something. You can't just sit here and wait. So let's see if there's a hidden river here. Biscov. No, thank you. No hidden rivers. Do I? I do not want to lead troops. But that's not me. That's my... Mar yeah, sure. He can lead troops. I don't mind. <sighs> so he made himself a king. That's uh, quite the quite good for for a lowborn. Uh, okay, so I actually was in the battle. I don't like being in a battle. Need to avoid that. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, that one is one. So, where's the next one? Can take that one then. Uh, yeah, got a lot of kingdoms here. Well, two. Uh, who's this? My chief of Flanders. How many troops do you have? Twelve thousand. Does he have event troops? He probably has event troops. That doesn't feel like a reasonable amount of troops for that tiny territory. He's probably the leader of a host or something. A tengui. This is this is strange. A tengui duke in the Netherlands. 
trying to take... What is it trying to take? It's trying to take the sea land. I do not intend to give him sea land because sea land is a holy site and I need that. You know what? Someone has territories here. That's not me. Oh, I guess not. I guess not of the counties flag. Anyway, I will kill his uh, 12,000 event troops and I will do it with uh, joy. I will hire the holy people and I will uh, raise my vassals, levis, except for these guys. This guy can these guys can stand down. Because they're too close to enemy ter territory. And please take a clever way around that troops those troops. Don't be stupid about it. No walking through enemy troops, please. that and yeah we can ignore them for now. Alright Flanders. So a lot of defensive wars apparently. Uh all of a sudden. Getting a tight though, but I like that. Ah oh, please. Well it was a reinforcement at least so that was not so bad. Go to the Oubliette and I can forget about you. Twelve thousand troops. I'm not gonna step on them because that would be stupid. They're on an island. I'm gonna have let them take it and uh, uh, wait for them on the other side of the sound. Um, yeah. How many troops do I have now? Current levy twenty-two thousand. That should be enough. Right. So silly, waiting for the last 70 troops. <laughs> Why do you do that? It's not like they're gonna make any difference at all. All these uprisings, that's just... That is just stupid. Kujawi. Gonna spend some time taking care of these rebels while I'm here. Um, I might as well. Ah, yes. Yeah, they are. They are blasting through these sieges, wasting four thousand troops in the process. I will not complain. I will. Uh, enjoy watching them die so adventurer Sotan is gathering men for some sort of attack on my territory what's your claim Duchy of Kipchak well that's over there so that's not it so what are you after Sotan of Anjogli well, I guess I'll have to assassinate him. It is uh, in Jaik to train troops. Where is Jaik? Find title. Jaik. County of Jaik, I guess. That's there. We will uh, send our spy mistress to increase our assassination chance. And you will die. Uh, there we go. Crisis averted. Uh, I do have this crisis on my hand. These adventurers, not. <laughs> they are not adventurers, they are Flanders. And they need to be taken care of. Pronto. So 
some rebels first to do it though. Like them. Thank you. Do you have money? 28, so I'll banish you. Thank you. Uh, Pronsk was converted. Great job. Yeah, now still need to take care of uh, Denmark. Hey, what's this? Is this an independent Gardariki? That is uh, unexpected. And that is a, a holy site. So I need that. Annoying. Well, not really. I uh, guess I can take it just as easily from him. High Chief Bernat, the Conqueror, died in battle. Thank you. So now his kid. Good luck with that. Uh, capturing people, going to Friesland. Uh, so yeah, that was it. What would I get from enforcing demands? 155 ducats. <sighs> Not really worth my time, I think. Uh, I'll just go with the white piece. That's good enough for me. I'm not one to hold a grudge. Uh, rebels. So what's this? Wendish Old Slavic Revolt and Peasant Revolt. Raya Van. Uh, that's up here. And up there. Send in the troops. You know what? Let's uh, get rid of the levies at least. And we'll keep the... The expensive ones. Ah, right. But at least like this, we can declare wars. So let's take a look at Garda Riki. Can I? Uh, yeah, I can declare a holy war for Huela. That's good. Uh, do we have a lot of territory? Moscow? No, not really. Just very splintered. A lot of duchies. A lot of one province duchies. Well, so I'll, I will get that. And Sweden. How about you? Sorry, I'm not going to kill you. Uh, oh, look at that. Holy War for Swipyard. I can't do that. Because Upland is another holy site. Temple of Uppsala. And he has that. And... How about you, Norway? What would it take... To get your holy site? Uh, Trendelag, right? Yeah, I can get that as well. This is good. I can get most of it. Right out of the... Right off the bat. Splendid. Just need to take care of these rebels. And the Norse faith is as good as reformed. No, I will not. Getting old. 53. Slavic. You know what? I don't really like Slavic. I need to switch to... Maybe I can't, by the way. Can I... Hmm. I'm not sure. Uh, no, I can't. Because I've already changed my capital. So I can't do that again. I need to... You can only do that once in your lifetime. <sighs> so... We'll have to wait. Thank you. Oh, look at that. 40 gold into my pocket. Uh, right.
right. Educating my grandson? Sure, I'll do that. I'll do that personally. And hopefully, I'll be able to make him into slab. Uh, yeah, someone needs to rot. Uh, timing. Oh, more revolts. What the? 25 minutes. Look at this. County of Torquay. Where's that? And what's the religion? It's Slavic. Well, it's gonna be Norse soon. Uh, let's see if we can't find any good people here. How about you, Steward of Sticked? Uh, you will get your own bounty because you're such a good steward. There you go. Enjoy. Ooh, how about that river crossing though? It's fine. You never know. Uh, rivers can be hard to spot, apparently. That's my lad. Look at that. He's brave. Uh, was that it? No. There they are. Need to kill them. Kill them good. Like that. Both of them done at the same time. Uh, 73 gold. And how about you? Nothing. You can still be banished. Now, we need to take a look at Gardariki. We need to get sh get Quellon. Yeah, we really do. Hey you. Rocksteady crew. Holy War for Quellon. How many troops does he have? He has 700 troops. Yeah. Good luck with that. I'll kill his troops over here. Uh, someone fabricating claims? Hmm. So you want the Duchy of Brunswick, but you're ambitious and zealous. So that's minus 100 opinion. Good luck with that. I'll just end this plot. So yeah, this episode 28 minutes. Let's not uh, repeat the um, episode from was it yesterday or the other day? That was 40 minutes long. And let us keep to the. Well, it's funny because when I started out uh, doing Let's Plays, uh, my intention was that the episodes were roughly 20 minutes that's uh, transitioned into 30 minutes episodes for some reason and I don't know why I hope people don't mind uh, because uh, it's uh, it's not intentional I think <laughs> just seems like time keeps dragging uh, yeah. So, can I kill all your troops and just have you give up? Something. Am I losing war score, by the way, for not occupying? No. That's something at least. Uh, so, who's this? It's my son. Uh, yeah. Slothful. Of course, yes. Uh, I should. How many troops will you give me? 840. Oh, it's something. Uh, raising some troops over here. Will this be enough? 600 troops? Yeah, that's more than enough. Uh, can we 
please. Take some sensible way in there. Not step to the troops. Uh, yeah, like I said. Sorry, that made quite a noise. Clapping my hands. Uh, I'm gonna end this episode here. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'm just gonna let my troops consolidate first. Just so I don't forget. But uh, thank you for watching. Uh, be sure to like. Uh, there's a button down there. Let's see. Thumbs up, I think. Click that. And I will kill this guy from Barcelona for you. Barcelona. I think of assassins. Yeah, well. If you want him to die, you're... You're gonna have to like my episode. Uh, but anyway, like, subscribe, comment, and I will see you in the next episode, and I will not be as distracted. Thank you. Goodbye. Good night.